Hello everyone, uh, my name is uh, Uncle Tay, uh, full name Tay Seng Ti. So I'm an automation engineer. When I'm young, okay, I, I was given, because I like to draw, so my, my dad was like, hey, you like to draw, why don't you draw the wall? I was like, I was so young, drawing with pencil, but he gave me the confidence to, what color you want? He, then he, that's where I started my first graffiti, when I'm only like uh, six years old. So I managed to find the picture. Okay, so this is the picture of me. Okay, uh, I did a uh, Disney. Okay, back then, uh, Disney is the thing, my era. Uh. Okay, so that was my six-year-old first graffiti. And this graffiti was taller than me. Okay, so I also uh, continue to do my artwork. And I always got passion for, for art. Uh, my dad is the, also the guy who bought me my first second-hand bicycle. And since then, 18 years old, I've been riding till now. Yeah, so I have a YouTube channel. So my YouTube channel is Tay Seng Ti. So a lot of my BMX friends say, who will Google Tay Seng Ti? But to me, I am where I am because my dad gave me my first BMX. So I wouldn't start my BMX hobby if it's not because of him. I will not start my graffiti if not because of him. So I also um, into DJing. Okay, so I do uh, uh, competitive uh, turntablenes back in the days when I'm my younger days. So I juggle uh, my schoolwork. Okay, so you'll be thinking, ah, got so many things. So everything we do, right, we have to really put in the heart to do something. If not, that, that finished product is really waste, waste time doing. That's why when I'm doing particular thing, I, even though I multitask, right, when I do graffiti, right, I really focus doing the graffiti. When I'm doing BMX, I focus on doing BMX. So one thing happened is um, because of one of the uh, video that I did, I fell. Okay, I fell and I, I... So injury for me is quite common. So I sprained uh, left ankle, right ankle, uh, both, both wrists. But it just uh, let itself recover. But one time I fell, I fell, I hurt my back. But it got worse every week until I cannot even sit up that bad, I have no choice but to go uh, for medical uh, sick uh, treatment. So they say that I go for surgery, I was like, what? So I, I went for a uh, second opinion. So the second opinion say, yes, you have to, you have to because there's a tumor. So it's very scary uh, because uh, I, I, I don't have any friends who, who have bad surgery. So I have to Google. So the, so the statistic is not so fantastic because like the superman he fell then he's he's like on wheelchair whole life then this taiwan singer uh, after the back surgery that went wrong he's now uh, she's known as the wheelchair singer so uh when i go for the surgery my parents don't know okay nobody know nobody visit me because it's covid so i i video call with my kids okay so i went through everything myself but i document the the whole journey Okay, so uh, I'm very glad okay, to my surgeon that uh, the, the operation was very successful. Even more uh, glad that the, the tumor was uh, negative, it's not cancer. So when I'm given a chance to do BMX, I want to give back to society. So you do good, good things will come, you know. So I'm given a second chance to ride my BMX again. So. I'm actually uh, teaching BMX and uh, I have collaboration with uh, uh, Viva uh, Foundation help raise funds for children with cancer, especially those uh, needy family. As an individual, I, I try to create this uh, environment where I teach uh, BMX to promote uh, BMX sports and I also uh, help uh, market my uh, bicycle shop. So I also, uh, on the same time, the parents who want to pay me, I said, no, just scan the QR code, uh, give some donation to the, the children with cancer. We raise uh, awareness, cancer awareness, to the public. Yeah, so I'm very glad that uh, PrayPen uh, gave me this platform to do this. How I get to know PrayPen is, uh, so first is because of graffiti. So I haven't, been, haven't touched spray can for like 20 years. So I have a BMX friend who opened a car shop. Okay, then he asked me to help do graffiti for him. So I think, oh, this would be a good chance for me to practice if I want to do for him. You know, I, I don't want to screw up his uh, wall, is it? So 
So I, I did graffiti for my, for, for Paypen P Center level one. So while doing it, I, I document what I do. So I also document other artists. So I, I combine and I just do a quick edit, a two months edit into a seven minutes video, which Paypen founder, they found the video and, and they find it interesting how the way I edit. So they, they uh, get me aboard to say, hey, why don't you help document uh, Paypen, uh, the, the activity here. So I, that's how I get involved and I become the social uh, videographer for Paypen. So thank you Paypen for giving me this trust and this opportunity. Always very grateful. I just want to let everyone know that, uh, yeah, yes, I do, I do graffiti, I do DJing, okay? I do piano, I do BMX more than 30 years and I'm still learning the craft. Always um, be humble, yeah. So uh, it's about the, the journey, learning journey. Yeah, so if you think you're the best, you'll never improve. So be humble and, and uh, stay positive. When given an opportunity, right, uh, take up the challenge, you know. So when, when uh, PayPen asked me to do a social media, I was like, what? Uh, I try my best because I'm just doing it as a hobby. But now you want me to do it because you cannot, you cannot shoot something and you, then after that you say, hey, this is the, the angle, not, not good. You have to come back and take. Because PrayPen won't be here anymore. I mean, Peace Center won't be here anymore. So everything that I do, right, I make sure that I, I have the finish good in mind, the different angle, different perspective. Always do your best. There's no, no, no guideline that saying what is right, what is wrong. So because if you don't try, right, you never know. If you want to do that graffiti stroke, Panama, drip, drip, so what? Just keep trying. Because the next stroke will be better. Today, it may not be the day that I land that trick. But one day I will land that trick. I will keep keep going and keep trying. Yes. So um, look out for my YouTube video. So this year I'm going to try um, doing headstand on a bicycle. Okay. That is my goal for this year. So look out for it. <laughs>